Hello everyone, Akas here from the GSM solution and welcome back to the another video. This video tutorial is about how you can easily remove the restriction or gray out on Apple ID. I will show you the easiest method. Keep watching these videos till the end every process is an importance. If you visit us first time, please hit the subscribe button, give thumbs up if it is helpful. Don't forget to press bell icon so that you never miss an important update. Alright, without further delay, let's learn how you fix the problem with Apple ID grayed out. Have you ever faced that problem? That is quite confusing. Actually, this function is for your security purpose. After that is activated, no one can access your Apple ID from setting and from App Store 2. That process makes your ID secure. But if you don't have any idea about, then really you got on trouble. Remember that is one of the powerful settings on iPhone that can stop so many functions like you can't install application on iPhone cause the App Store icon is in hidden state. You cannot delete any applications. While you want to delete some app from the iPhone, no any delete option can be seen. Result you cannot delete any application too. You can't change the iPhone passcode. While you go to setting, there is no any option about face ID and password source. You can't change account like iCloud or any account that I already mentioned on the topic. And so many functions are disabled. <coughs> Let's discuss step by step. Go to setting, scroll down, then go to screen time. Here you can see content and privacy restriction. Here you can see that is on. The first option is iTunes and App Store purchase. In here you can see installing app don't allow means you cannot install new application because iTunes store are in hidden state. Simply allow if you want to install application. Below, you can see the deleting app don't allow means you can delete any installed application from the iPhone. Simply allow if you want to delete desired application.
The third option is App Purchase. Don't allow means you cannot purchase new application from a store. Simply allow it if you want to have purchase. Scroll down. Here is so many settings that affect other default settings on your iPhone. If you go to setting and see there is no any passcode option available. Here you can see passcode change option don't allow means you cannot change the iPhone passcode from setting. The second one is account changes. The second one is account changes option don't allow means you cannot change Apple ID or, or the Apple ID option is in DJ world state or gray out state. Simply allow it to access the Apple ID from setting. Here is so many settings from you can set restriction on your application, Apple ID and even the screen lock password. Without your wish, no one can do anything on your iPhone. For you to share these videos with your friends and loved ones, consider subscribing to the channel if you haven't already. I am Akash. Peace out till the next time.